Uh, welcome to my visual C sharp lottery number generator. Um, uh, I've actually developed one of these programs in uh, visual C++. I just felt uh, it would be a good idea to develop uh, a version in C sharp. So that's it folks. If you if you like to see the codes, I'm gonna show you the code, and you guys will see how it is generated. I will also put the code in my share drive. If you have any need for it, just let me know. I'll forward it to you. Okay, I have a pause right there, and I have a reset button, and uh, generate lottery numbers. So what I will do next is to actually take you to the coding area where you see how it was uh, put together so I'm just going to pause and uh, go to the coding area and you see how the whole system was put together but before then let me show you the form so I just close the property okay that's my form right there as you guys can see, I have uh, six timers, and the interval for this timer, the way I've set it, let me show you the property for the timer. You can see I just sort of like set it just anyhow. The main reason for doing that is to make sure there is no repetition of uh, numbers within the text box okay that's for the timer and uh, I also have six text boxes or six text box text box one two three four five six a button call reset and uh, my main generator right there that's it and another button just to pause the numbers generated now for the coding what I did was uh, double click on uh, timer 1 and just enter the following lines of code integer number 1 random rand equals new random integer number one equals uh, this very random number that I declare here and uh, the numbers I would like you to randomize is between 1 and 49 and I'll pass my number one which is the integer in here converting it to a string which is then assigned to the text box and the same process repeated for timer number two timer number three four and five and timer number six the other thing I did was uh, for the both things I set all the timers here. Force. That's for the reset. But sorry, that's for the pause button, which is the button right here. Let me move this one down. This very button here. You can see it's set to force. This is for the reset. It's just to clear all the content in the or the value in the text box and for button 2 that's to enable the timer which is the main generator right here number generator that's all I did for the coding there there isn't much to it if you want I can always send you the code and you guys can just knock yourself out well uh, just gonna run the program again and you see how it works it's very simple to create you can even create something much better I've not bothered to change the interface 
I just left her the same interface that I use for the C++ so let's go into visual C++ uh, visual C sharp form and you guys see the whole system that is right there and now we now run it I've already compiled it I will run it and you see what I'm talking about and again like I said if you have any need for the codes just get in touch and I'll forward the code to you as a lot of numbers and I'm going to pause the number button now and that's it so if you want reset generate another number generate another number pause and that's it right there so it's very easy to create this kind of game and it's fun as well well I'm gonna call it a day now so you all have a nice day now bye